easier to communicate with those who are most alive. So sometimes it's easier to communicate with people who are like us or share similarities. Any other reasons? Organization. For organization. In what way can you elaborate? <clears throat> well, I mean, like, I have a census for people in the countries, and then you're supposed to put, like, your race and all these things you identify with, and that way they can find out statistics about it. Right. So having specific characteristics grouped together so you can see, like, how maybe poverty or how housing or certain um, issues might affect a certain particular group. Any other reasons why we categorize? So it's easier often than actually like trying to dig, dig, dig a bit deeper to get to know somebody to see where those other similarities are. So I'll ask you to sit down. Please 
disregard? Mm -hmm. Testing, testing. Thank you. Yeah. I'm so dumb. You're welcome to answer however you 
Our teacher sent us here to get uh, <laughs> like maps. <laughs> oh, <laughs> maps. We got maps. We got maps. We got maps. So the folks guessing had a hard time figuring out who to trust in terms of the answers you were getting and the help you need. I got this like weird sense of satisfaction like watching them struggle. I, like, <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Sure you <laughs> <laughs> How about for the folks who were in the middle of the interview, uh, what was it like? I was really confused. Yeah, was oh. everybody was just their selves. <laughs> yeah. I thought it was going to be something with like identity. It just, it just seems like everyone's laughing looking at you like, ah, uh, you suck. <laughs> you were getting frustrated? Yeah. How come? Because I, 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 I don't know, it was like. He was, yeah, I saw his face. It was, it was like, I tried helping them, but they were like, no, 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 so you were frustrated because even when you were trying to help, it felt like they weren't receiving it yeah. and making use of it. Jeremy. <laughs> Did anyone else feel like, I guess, vicarious frustration watching them do it? Oh, no. Yeah. 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 Wait, what? Watching Andy. It was funny seeing like different reactions. Oh, that's funny. I was reacting. That's pretty bad. Jeremy. Like, totally not frustrated. I'm like, I'm just like, oh, god damn it, I suck. Jeremy, how did it feel when you were the last I, I was just doing, I knew up from the beginning, but like, you know, that's why I'd be out there longer. Um, what really helped you figure out how the group was divided? Well, when, he, when he found out first, and then he, and then he asked me the one question, like, do you like odd features? So I'm like, oh wait, odd numbers, even numbers. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't get that. <laughs> how do you think the group was divided? I didn't know. It was like February and June, I thought it was like first half of the year at first, and then the first half of June, and I was like, what? And then, the, then the, uh, he said, he's like, even, he said something even, I forgot. Oh, he, he, said, he said something side. about his foot, so I was looking at the people with like even shoe color. <laughs> I was looking at the people shoe, shoe color, and, and then I'm like, wait, people wearing black over there, and then they're like, try to look at their pants and their shirts and stuff, but that didn't work. <laughs> so it could have been something obvious, it could have been something more visual, instead of actually something a bit more hidden. Um, when we were doing this activity, what did it remind you of? How would we do an activity like this? <laughs> Mess with cold. <laughs> not be a part of the other group. And moving forward, we recognize that in order to actually change that, to create something, what, what often people fight for is equality, um, you have to first acknowledge that it exists. You have to first acknowledge that, this, that these divisions exist. Um, it's easy to say that we are all one, we're all the same, when in reality, we actually, the, our, the differences are real. Um, and so, to move down the staircase um, requires a lot of different work. It requires thinking that power doesn't have to be concentrated at the top, that we can actually redistribute power and share it among each other. Um, that in order to move towards equality, we need first equity, so creating fairness um, in response to the, the, some of the injustices or wrongs that have occurred. And then only then can we move towards justice. So we shift our values and realize, actually, you know, I can decide what's good and bad. I can decide what I value and what's worthy or not. I don't have to listen to my parents all the time. I don't have to listen to my friends all the time. 
I can also question what the school teaches me. I can also question what the media tells me. But actually, I can figure that out for myself, what matters and what doesn't. Um, and ideally, that we can shift to building, rebuilding what community really means and, sh and shifting away from the false beliefs that we might have about each other or others might have about us. And then we can move towards equality. Um, so that's the staircase. Uh, that's quite a bit. I don't know if anyone has any thoughts or questions or comments. I'm just going to show you a video and then we'll do the checkout.